Today we're taking a look at the Woods wireless remote. Now this is a little wireless remote that allows you to um, plug in and or turn on and off, I should say, your exterior outlets. Now I saw this on an Amazon deal, picked it up, thinking, wow, that would be great for Christmas lights or who knows what. But the price was so good, I figured let's just pick it up. Now there's not really a lot to this device. Let's see if I can get out the little keychain. I do hate packaging like this. There we go. I really hate packaging like that. So now that we've got that all out of the way, let's actually take a look at the device. Um, now it's a single outlet. There's a very short power cable here and then a single outlet right there to plug it into. Um, there is a little screw placement right there or nail placement so you can mount that firmly against the exterior of your house or wherever you want it. Um, there is Oh, that's basic guidelines on that. Um, a battery pack, comes pretty low with a battery. On, off, really not a lot to say about that. But let me, here it is, here is the instructions. Let's take a quick look at the instructions that come with it. And then I can give you my thoughts. So really not a lot to say about it. Uh, plug in a three prong for grounding to use. Press on, press off. That's about it. Really not a lot to say. Spanish and English instructions, pretty straightforward um, device. So in short, anywhere in the exterior house where you got power, plug this in, plug in whatever you want to wirelessly control here, whether it be Christmas lights or other devices. And then you have an on off switch right there, which is pretty nice. Um, there's a few things here that this um, is useful for, really anything you want to have powered on it. But my main thought was Christmas lights here. I do have a timer, but I kind of, the thing I hate about timers, it makes it very clear that you're not home when you're using them. So I like to have the ability to manually turn it on and off, rather it be from the bedroom or wherever. Um, so that's kind of cool. Or if you have, I know some people have high wall sockets or, or plugs by, um, ledges or second floor balconies in their house, which are not easy to get to, but you may want to put something powered up there. This could be a good option for that. I, I used to be a realtor and I saw a couple homes like that where you needed a ladder to get up there, but there happened to be an outlet there if you wanted to plug in some type of decorations for Christmas and so forth to some type of ledge or other decorative area in your house. This would have been cool for that. So you could set up your Christmas decorations up there in your house and plug that in somewhere you can't regularly easily get to. Um, let me go test this out, come back and give you a full review of it. Do a full review. All right, well, I played around with it a little bit and not really a lot to say about it. Now, to use it, just hold it for a split second and it really only needs to be a split second to hold it. And it turns the switch on and off. The response time is very quick between this going on and off. Um, I, you know, one other use I thought of this is a lot of people have like Roku's and other streaming players that they, they're concerned because there's no true on off. They just kind of go to sleep. And if you're really kind of concerned about it draining the battery or run a power bill, I should say, or um, whatever you're concerned about bandwidth usage, this could be a nice little device to power on off your Roku or other device. I don't really think that's a real necessity. I wouldn't really recommend doing that, but it's an option. Um, I'll probably use this for Christmas lights and I'll just kind of keep it around. Who knows what this is good for. It really is a case by case usage on whatever you need it for. But the time between sending the message and this going on and off was a few seconds or less than a second, I should say. Um, the range of it was pretty good. Pretty much anywhere in my house. I have a two story house here, pretty mid sized American household. And anywhere in my house, I was able to use this, um, even without direct line of sight. I wouldn't say it's a crazy great range on it, but I was pleased sitting in my living room, pressing it and watching the lights in the front of my house go on and off and so on. So questions, comments, let me know. Otherwise, two thumbs up. Um, it's simple, it's basic, it does what it says it's going to do and does it well. Otherwise, please subscribe for more guy reviews or check out our main page, Court Cars News, for more um, ways to save money, guides on more streaming media and other cord cutting related ways to cancel your cable TV but still watch all the shows you want to watch. Again, that's Court Cars News for our main channel. Otherwise, please subscribe here for more random reviews of whatever I find out there. Find out there.